so open up the user app flutter project and now in here on our homepage dot dot file in our users app we are going to add the uh, drawer so for that purpose above the body of the scaffold widget drawer widget we will add a header then of course the body of our drawer drawer header we will display an icon icon start person and then inside a column widget we will display two things that is the username and then a title profile so this is all about our header okay the drawer header now let's implement the body after the header let's add a divider to make it looks beautiful the user interface so we can say const divider widget the height will be 1 the color will be color start white and the thickness will be 1 then we will after the divided let's add some space and then we will implement the body that is our list style so for example the first button or first list style will be also we will add another button another list style and this will be for logout alongside uh, with I mean inside the list style for example at the start we that is at the left side of the list style we display icon button leading mean the less left side of our list style okay if you want you can also display the title that is the text for this list style which will be after the icon at the right side of the icon so for example for this one we can say this is our uh, that is after the leading you can and this one will be logout so now we have the drawer with the header with the header and with the body items that is with two list styles so how we can open this drawer for that uh, we need to add a key to our drawer that is first of all we have to initialize here with the help of this s key we can handle the click event for the drawer button which we will add at the top left of our home page so using this uh, s key which means scaffold key we can handle in here in the scaffold widget we can say key s key and now uh, we can add a button for the uh, drawer so when the user click on that button we will open up the drawer and close the drawer with the help of our this scaffold key and that button we will add inside the body after the google map so we can say let's add a comment here drawer button okay and of course this is our google map so we can say position widget
so we will have this hamburger button okay at the top left of our home page which will have a uh, box decoration this property is applied to okay and when the user click on this button what we want to do with the help of our s key which is scaffold key we can we want to open the uh, drawer so we can say dot open drawer so now let's just install the app on our phone so now if we click on this button this is the button okay our drawer button as you can see it is at the top left of our home page okay at the home page at the top left if you want to move it uh, that is to decrease the space from the top you have to just decrease this value for example 38 okay let's proceed with 36 will be good so now when you click on this button which is our this icon button as you can see when we click on that it will open up the drawer as you can see that and then you already know that this drawer UI we implemented here okay this is our this drawer for which we have the header okay the background color for this is pure black also the box decoration color is pure black now if you want to change the color for example this is our box okay for which we apply black and also for this whole container in which our destroyer header is as a whole black is applied also okay so if you want to change of course you can change it from here like you can change it to white 10 and this one to white 24 so it will look like this so it is totally up to you with which color you want to proceed so this was our header as you can see okay this is our header code where you see that uh, we have a row inside that row first we have this icon which you see here and then after that we have name and that title as you can see we have this icon person and then we have the uh, name and the profile title then after the header you know that we have the divider which you see here you can see we have this divider this white you see if you see this black color this is basically the background color which comes with the header okay this is the background color which comes with the header for example if you change it to white then you will see the difference okay it is really important to understand you see as a whole on this container this white color is applied okay that is which is our header you see the difference now so as a whole this is black color that's why uh, when you see then this black color is with our uh, container which is as a whole applied on our complete header then inside the drawer header you know that box decoration has white 10 color which you see this color okay this is applied on the drawer header and then inside that uh, decoration which you see okay inside that decoration we have row in which we have the icon and the username and profile then after the header we have a divider which you already see okay this white single line of course if you want uh, you can change it to gray color gray color will looks good as our background is black you see that if you want to display a divider at the start also that is above the header then you can do that as well you can see that okay here we have now the divider which looks like this now so anyways it is totally up to you to make the design more beautiful then after comes the body and you know that in the body we have two list style one is the about one is the logout button which you see here already okay and of course if you want you can also add some space between the name and the title so inside the header between name and title we can say const size box of height 10 will be 
enough let's decrease it to 4 10 is too much okay like this as you can see one more thing is instead of this icon if you want to display any image from the assets okay for example we have two images avatar man and avatar woman so what you can do is you can simply write here image dot asset instead of the icon and you can say that assets just to make the design beautiful you can add any image icon okay if you have you have to just add that image inside the images folder so, and then access it like this by providing the complete reference if I want to add let's say this avatar and of course you have to specify the width and height for it webp it is of type webp and then the width and height for our image 60 will be enough you can see that okay and for example you can add this one if you want any image icon you want you can just access it okay it is totally up to you whatever you like and also let's change the color of this to white 24 so that it looks a little bit highlighted 38 is okay so yeah this is how we can add a drawer in our flutter app and you already understand the code first of all let me explain we have this button you already know hamburger button okay for which we have created this box decoration this beautiful around design okay in which we have this hamburger button when the user click on it with the help of our scaffold key start s key we open up the drawer and the drawer ui you already understand it is simple first inside this container we have implemented our whole drawer which you can see okay which has a background color black 87 the width for the drawer is 255 this is the complete width okay which is 255 so then inside the drawer uh, we have first uh, as we want to display the items perpendicular wise that's why we use list view so first we have a divider which you see here at the top okay this gray color thin line thin white line then we have header in the header you know that uh, we the height for that at 160 which you already see okay and a color is applied on that for example as a whole the container has black 54 color but we are using box decoration and for box decoration we use this specific this color which is white 10 which you see okay this highlighted black color in the background okay this is our box complete box and inside that box first we have image which you see and then we have name and profile and this is all inside this parent row widget this row is a parent widget for image asset and for this column and you know that inside this column we have name and profile that's why we see everything in a row first we have image and then in the same row we have the name and profile and if you see name and profile is in vertical direction which is which means for this we use this column widget okay that is vertical direction and then of course after the header we have again this divider which you see here okay this gray color line and then we have the body where we have these two list style or you can say these two buttons